In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to put text on a path in Affinity Designer for iPad. Here we go. First, I'll just take the defaults. Now I'm going to create a path. Pen tool, we're just going to go click. Click and drag to get a nice arc here. And click. There we go. Now I'm going to grab this little text tool, just to text, and I'm just going to basically click the path. And it puts it on the path, so right now I'm going to just crank up the font. To, I don't know 47 and then I'm gonna type this is text on a path so basically all I did there was select and now I can grab the little green carrot to move it on the path and if I pull the red carrot that's gonna start to flip it upside down like so but I'm gonna put it back you can adjust its position on the path like that. And it gives you that little red line. Watch right, right in the center. It gives you a red line when it thinks it's hitting the center alignment there. So that's text on a path. It's that simple. Um, again, the workflow is, if I were to do it again, click, create, by dragging, okay, little points like that. Then we grab the text tool, click on the line. It just drops it on there. And now we type, this is a message on a path. Okay, then we can move the carrot and move it along the path. That's it, hope you enjoyed that. Um, subscribe if you'd like to see more of this sort of thing. Um, frankly, I don't do a lot of iPad tutorials, so this is new for me, um, but I thought it would be useful to share. Thanks everyone.